Hello everyone. Welcome to Nebula's first top three stories of importance pulled from the latest headlines. Number one is a recent alert from Harrowville, a small town in Quebec, Canada, has highlighted how important international workers are to most economies as most developed countries face severe labor shortages and are unable to cope with the growing population to support their own societies. On average, every two in every five Canadian employers struggle to recruit skilled workers. And if you think the problem is confined only to Harrowville, then you're wrong. The problem is widespread and in developed countries. But according to OECD report, Canada was hit hardest in her second half of 2021. And now the government is trying tooth and nail to attract expat workers by offering perks like subsidized housing. So if you think Canada can be your second home, now will be the time to act on it. For any related information, you can also check out our link nebula.com. Moving on to the second story, Germany ranks fourth in international student enrollments with the massive number of enrollments in 2021 to 2022. Germany is creating a huge buzz. As stated by the German Academy Exchange Service Start report, around 350,000 of Germany's almost 3 million substantial student population were international students during the last winter semester. Despite a drop during COVID, the number is rising dramatically partly due to the extension of the study programs by the existing international students. The president of DART, Joy Bratu Mukherjee, continues to enjoy the success and mentions that it was only possible due to the continuous efforts. Once again, Germany maintains its reputation and continues to welcome all the scholars. Do check out our upcoming Nebula talk on APS certification on 18th of November, which is mandate requirement for all the scholars studying in Germany. We have come to the last story of the day. And guess what this is? It's a good news for all the Indians. Are you troubled with the long ways and visa cancellation in London? Well, not anymore. Visa facilitation service has opened a new Indian Visa Application Centre, IVAC, in Marylebone, Central London. It was inaugurated by the Indian High Commissioner to the UK, Vikram Daraiswamy, on 1st November 2022. You will be surprised that this is the third IVAC in London and a total of 10 IVACs in UK. But due to the long waits and delays and sometimes cancellations too, VFS Global has opened the third IVAC in London and also introduced the process of collecting documents at doorstep and checking the forms online for a very small cost. Aditya Arora, the COO of Visa Felicitation Service Global, is determined to tackle customer challenges and due to his continuous efforts now, there is an increase about 40,000 appointments per month. All right then, Skilligens, before I go, I want you to quickly go subscribe to our channels on YouTube, Instagram and LinkedIn for more such news, international work and study opportunities and invaluable life and career hacks. Signing off.